Hello and welcome back to Here We Tow. So this is it, this is Motorhome Collection Day. We're all packed up in the coral and we are setting off up to Stoke-on-Trent to Cara Motorhomes to collect our new Adria Compact Supreme DL. So we're excited, aren't we? A few hours drive, see how the uh, see how the traffic is going up there, but hopefully it'll be a nice smooth drive and transition period. So yes, <laughs> a transition period. Yes. Yes, <laughs> handing it back and finding out about the new one. Yeah, so the um, the Coral's been part X'd, as you well know, so goodbye Coral, we've really enjoyed this motorhome. Absolutely. Um, and a lot of people said, are you sure you're making the right decision swapping? We did we did put a lot of thought in it, but um, yeah, we do want the DL still, definitely. Um, I think that'll just suit us. Um, hopefully when you guys all see it, um, you'll see why we fell in love with it. So we're going to hit the road and... Um, and go and get the DL, which I'm all excited about. So come on, let's go. Let's go. See you in a bit. Bye. So here we are, three hours later, and we are at Cara Motorhomes in Caravan. As if by magic, via the M5 and M6. It took us about three hours, but we are here, and we are excited because this here is the new Adria Compact Supreme DL that we ordered back in October and sorry Jules and there is the Adria Coral that we bought on the 1st of April to put us on and it has been a fantastic motorhome we will be sad to see it go it was a good choice in the end it after all that head and heart and it was a good decision it was a was it a it, it, it was a both it was a head and heart decision but it worked really well anyway so um I'm told it's sold as well. So whoever's bought that motorhome, congratulations! Yeah, you've got a you've belt. Got, it's a brilliant motorhome. You'll love it. So as for our DL, um, we have had the air conditioning fitted, which was part of our deal. We will be doing a review on uh, motorhome air conditioning. We've had motorhome Wi-Fi wi fitted. That was something we researched and chose. We've got no connections whatsoever with motorhome Wi-Fi. We and that is the 5G flex. So there will be some yeah. information coming on that. We're going shortly, to do a vlog on to, that, uh, which will be see that that'll be motorhome Wi-Fi. Uh, it's quite expensive, and yes, we've paid for that. So that's on there. And then we've got a telly. We didn't go with cello. Um, we decided to splash out on Avtex. So we've gone for. For what I would say is, is one of the best out there. We've gone for an Av Avtex TV, 21.5 uh, inch. Yep. Again, no connection with Avtex. We bought that. Um, the Wi-Fi one just to... Yeah, I don't think we'll be doing a review of the telly unless anyone wants it, but that's that's what we've got. So what we're going to do is we'll have a quick look around the DL now. I'm going to do a proper review um, in a couple of days. It'll be out on the channel. We're going to go to Summerswood today and tomorrow night for a bit of a shakedown. Um, and and get a review done. Just so to enjoy some time in it now. Yeah, we've got to unpack everything. Been waiting everything. so long. Well, let's have a look round it. Absolutely. So you grab the camera, Jules. Thank you, because you're good with the camera. I'm not. It's a disaster when I touch it. So this is the Compact Supreme DL. It's a seven meter motorhome. Uh, this one is the nine speed automatic, and it's the 160 brake horsepower. So it's the bigger engine. Silver cab, silver sides. On the compact. Uh, you don't get the long arms, so you can see these are short. So when I was saying about this motorhome being shorter, it's because of the wing mirrors are. Um, we've then got, as I say, silver side, silver body, black decals. Habitation door is on the right. I'll just open the habitation door so you can poke your head in there. Say it is obviously brand new, but there we go. That's the Dianet lounge that I really like. That was a big selling point, um, that lounge. We come down, when I do the review, I'll do about all the bits and pieces that are on the motorhome and obviously the big garage that's on it. At the back, again, it's silver again. Uh, we've got the uh, reversing camera up there. And then we come down on this side and again, on the near side, you can see it's just all uh, one big uh, silver piece. You'll notice there's no vents for the fridge and freezer. This motorhome has a compressor fridge and freezer, which does not run on gas, only on electric. Again, I'll talk more about that in the review because I think that's quite interesting, the compressor fridge and freezer and how with a solar panel, which we've got um, off gridding is pretty easy uh, and it'll save you money on gas as well. And with gas being in short supply at the moment, that's probably a bit of a bonus. So there we go, that is our new Adria Compact Supreme DL. We are absolutely made up with it. Um, Jules, are you going to dive back in here or? 
Mm, no, really. no, super. So there we go. I just wanted to show you around. As I say, we're off to Summerswood for two nights. Thank you to John at Car Remote Homes. He's been absolutely fantastic, really helpful and kept us informed um, throughout the whole process of purchasing the new motorhome. So it's uh, it's been a really straightforward process. So there we go. I'll catch you in a couple of days with a full review of the DL. But for now, as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.